How to use Vox Cloud to monitor our devices. First, we downloaded our Fox Cloud from the App Store. Step 1. Register a monitoring account. In the upper left corner, you can select the appropriate language, and in the upper right corner, you can configure Wireless LAN. New users can click to register a new account. Read all relevant regulations and click Agree. Select I am an owner and click Complete all your account registration information and then click Submit. Then, return to the login page, fill in your account and password, agree to policy requirements, and click Sign in. Congratulations, the plant has now been successfully created. Step 2. Create a new plant. Click Create a plant. Then you can add devices. Scan or enter your SN code. Click Confirm. Fill in all the details about the new plant. By the way, if your installer has set up the plant, your account will automatically load the plant. Click Save. Congratulations, the plant has now been successfully created. Introduction to the homepage. At the top of the homepage, you can see weather information, alarm notification, system status and inverter work mode, and data update time. If you have multiple power stations, you can click on the name of your current station for free switching. In the middle of the homepage, it is System Energy Flow Diagram. You can view essential real-time data, and you will notice that the entire diagram changes its theme over time. At the bottom of the homepage is the summary data, including self-sufficiency, today PV yield, self-consumption. All of these are daily data. Click Quick Settings here, where you can easily access essential settings. Click on Grid Charge Setting. It allows for two distinct grid charge periods. You can set the Battery Reserve Capacity. You can also set the System Minimum SOC. You can choose to set the Work Mode to self-use or feed in priority and available work modes may differ between inverter models. You can automatically switch between work modes throughout the day using the mode schler. The mode scheduler allows for more advanced charge-discharge scheduling. Swipe to the left, and you can access technical statistical analysis, including production analysis, consumption analysis, and information about the energy balance. Moreover, you'll find that energy data can be displayed daily, monthly, yearly, or over a lifetime. Introduction to the device page, including inverter and battery. Back on the homepage, you can click on the inverter to quickly access the device page. Here, you can add new devices, and we have categorized all devices, including inverters, batteries, and accessories. You can see the current information for each device. Click on Detail Parameters, they are all real-time data in the Analysis Graph. You can view more specific data charts, which can also be displayed daily, monthly, yearly, or over a lifetime. Returning to the homepage, click on Battery, and you can quickly enter the Battery Device page. You can see the current information for the battery. In Battery Setting, you can set Charge, Discharge Times and Sock Settings just like through Quick Settings. On the Info page, click on Detailed Parameters, and you can see more detailed information about the battery, all of which is the most recent data. In the Analysis Graph, you can view all charge and discharge data charts, which can also be displayed daily, weekly, monthly, yearly, or over a lifetime. Introduction to the Me page. On the Me page, click on Wireless LAN Configuration, where you can configure the network for all your devices. Click on Data, and you can download data reports for different devices and time periods according to your needs. On the Contact Us page, you can directly get our contact information and receive support from a professional after-sales consultant.